My dad was a man of few words, but by his example, I learned a lot. You know, I'm a parent now. I have an 11-year-old and I have a 12-year-old, and I've read multiple parenting books, multiple. And the concepts that I see in those books, and I look back in my own childhood, and my dad and mom weren't able to articulate these points verbally, but they did it, you know, by having dinner every day with us. My dad had many times three and four jobs, and I'll explain in a minute, but what he would do is he would make sure that in dinner time he was there. Now, dinner sometimes meant eight o'clock at night because he worked from sunup to sundown. But if that was the case and mom insisted, we wait. It, it set an example for me as a parent that I'm never too busy for my kids. I come home and I work in an office, so it's a different kind of tired. You get more stress. But you open the door and, and your kids are like, hey, we've been waiting for you. I'm glad you're here. Can we go swimming or can we play some basketball? Can you play catch? I got the soccer ball. Will we be goalie? And you know what? I look at my wife and I just smile and I think, I think of my dad. And I think, you know, as, as tired as he was and he made the time for me, then absolutely let's play. Let's do it. And we'll be out there till it's dark and, you know, and I tell him, we, I have, you know, dinner with my kids every night. 